Suryana. I'm from Ukraine. I'm working in IBM as software test engineer. Seven years ago, I've been right where you are at the moment. I've been in transitional year in Beaumont Girls School. And uh, since then, how to use that? Oh, Andy. Since then, I've been very busy. At the moment, I am a young, bright, ambitious IT professional. I'm a student on the last year of my education in Dublin Institute of Technology. I do information system and information technology degree there. And I'm also a mom to two years old girl, so I've been busy. And uh, when I was your age, which was seven years ago basically, I wanted to do many different things. I want to be president. I dropped that. <laughs> I liked architecture. I want to be a rock star. I want to work in the police and I want to be a lawyer. Eventually, I stick around for accounts because accounting was pretty stable and everybody needs accounts, but it was very boring and after three months I gave up and I moved on to sales. I was good in sales. Sales were exhausting and I didn't feel that they grow, so I moved on to well, I got promoted, so I was managing a small team, and it kept me going for another year, and I got bored with this as well. And then I tried to be self-employed, and as a, as a businessman, I suck, basically. <laughs> Didn't make any money. I learned how to do websites, and doing webshops, and this kind of things. And, uh, but being self-employed helped me to understand that where I want to be is IT because every day I can do something different and I can be part of the tomorrow world, if you know what I mean. And uh, I um, joined IBM this year and I love it. In IBM, I'm working in IBM SCORE project. SCORE is a software which helps health industry companies to maintain the, their documentation about new drugs and to comply with different kind of legislations. It's pretty boring, but I'm testing the software and uh, my job allows me to try and break the software in all the possible ways that you can think of or try to, or, or all the possible ways that I've been taught to. And uh, so it's pretty much testing, 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 testing. I'm trying to break software in most sophisticated ways. I'm assuring quality and integrity of any changes that have been made to the software. And I'm lucky enough to use the latest software and latest technologies for testing and developing, developing software that's been developed by IBM. And uh, I found it exciting. As you can see, there's Lotus Nodes, there's Rational Team Concert, Clear Quest. Those are programs that any developer would use in any company around the world. And they've been developed by IBM and I got exposed to all these cool technologies with my work. So my message to you today is that two things, right? One of them is that IT is cool, it really is. Uh, it makes your heart beat faster and makes you to live every single second of this life. And uh, IT can help you to realize your vilest the most wild dream you can possibly have if you dare to dream, and if you dare to dream big. So another thing to consider about IT is beauty of diversity. As I was saying to many of you guys, like 10 years ago, you would go like, okay, I don't know what to do, like I'm 16 years old, and there's exciting times to choose a profession, I'm not sure what to do to be. So you could go for business, for example, and you knew, okay, I'll get some job and pretty much everywhere. Well, the world's changed since then very much, so business won't help. If you want to be able to work anywhere, it's good to choose IT because IT gives you a lead in your profession. So whenever you choose later, if you're not ready to decide, if you know IT stuff, you'll be leader in your profession. If you don't know IT stuff, you won't be leader. So as simple as it is. The beauty of diversity is also that IT is not about computers and cables anymore. If you like art, you can be designer, you can design graphic interfaces for people. You can make the work, world more beautiful through your work. If you like uh, cables and computers, some people still do that, you can go for system administration or hacking or stuff. If you like uh, create new things, if you want to add value to this world, not that other people don't, but uh, if you want to to solve challenges, to make lasting change, you can go for software development. If you're not sure, choose a degree, like 
ID, I think it's pretty cool, uh, which gives you exposure to different aspects of IT and it will help you to understand in depth what you want to do. In IT you can do a couple of years of this, a couple of years of this, it's, it's everywhere, you know, and there's very many different professions you can choose. Okay, there is one good thing about IT, as you noticed I have a strong accent, I'm not from around here, uh, I'm from Ukraine, it's like 2,000 kilometers Russian side, you know, that direction, and uh, but I'm IT person, so there are no borders for IT people. If you are good in IT, whenever you want to go to whichever country you want to check out, you'll be there because you know everybody wants you if you're good. And uh, IT is a profession to be if you're like traveling. Now uh, you'll be happily employed. People will pay you money to have fun, to create things, and to reach your potential. Now, IT, another thought, IT is changing the way work looked and worked very fast and very dramatically. So, uh, I'll put it this way, right? I'm a young parent, I have a two years old daughter. And despite the fact that she cannot speak yet, it's confusing, I speak at home, Ukrainian, Russian, Polish and English, so she won't talk soon, right? But, <laughs> but, she is better than me in Angry Birds, okay? And she's playing it on iPad. To turn on the thing, she needs to press the home button. She needs to slide it away. She needs to input my password. <laughs> she needs to find this application between hundreds of other applications which there. I have no clue how she managed to do this with this little head of hers, you know? And uh, she's also checking out the YouTube. So she lo watches all these cartoons and kids songs and stuff. And she's removing applications from my iPhone, so I'm not able to call on it from it anymore because she's misplaced somehow the application. I don't know how to do it. I'm an IT person. She's two years old. She cannot talk. The way those kids have their own ways with IT is apparently so amazing. This is the users that will ch tell us, IT people, how the world of tomorrow will look like. She comes to the big screen, which is like half of wall screen, and she paints it. I found the screen pretty impressive, okay? It cost me like 1,000 euro for heaven's sake. And she's complaining that the, it's not touch screen, right? Because she got used to it. And uh, this makes me wonder, will I be able to talk to this little girl when she's 20? Because I really hope to. And, uh, this is why I want to be in IT. I want to be able to talk to my child the same language. I don't want to be like my grandma who doesn't know how to turn on TV with a you know, remote and stuff. So the way the world looked 20 years ago is you know, the way your parents know it. It's not this way anymore. Imagine your world without internet. Internet didn't exist 25 years ago. There was no internet, right? Now you have a Facebook, you probably can't live without it, right? All other things. And just try to imagine how the world will be looking like in 20 years' time. You've seen the, the things guys from Google were talking today. I mean, they're happening, they're possible, the world is changing, right? And um, if you want to be, if you're ambitious enough to take a charge, to take initiative, and be one of those great, bright IT souls who is going to shape the world of tomorrow, go for it, go for IT. You don't have to be super cool smart, they'll teach you things, you know. And <laughs> if you're there to dream, to change the world the way you can imagine it, go for IT. Dream, oh, hold on, there, yeah. So if you have a courage to be one of the bright IT souls that shape the world of tomorrow, go for IT and dream big. Dream as big as you can possibly imagine. IT is a profession that can realize your most wild dreams. Yay! <laughs> Any questions? No questions, then let's give a good hand. <laughs>